Since I began this YouTube channel back in 2010, I always considered it as a visual diary of my life. Nothing but moments of stuff that I just wanted to share with the rest of you people. And I didn't take it seriously, you know, in the beginning. If you scroll down to the very, very bottom of my video list, you're going to see, if I'm not mistaken, uh, videos about me and my family being out here during a blizzard. I made about four or five videos like that. And we were just having ourselves a good time out there making snow angels and messing around with some huge icicles that were, you know, frozen, hanging from buildings and stuff. And, uh, yeah, you know, there was videos like that in the very beginning. And then I decided to make uh, some Christian, they call it, you know, many of you will consider it as Christian rap if you decide to check out uh, my music. And I really got involved deeply into that. I started to uh, take the time and put my lyrics together and just put the beats, you know, combine the beats with the rhymes. And then I would just do my thing. And then I just shared that here on my channel. Now, as the years went by, I, st I decided to uh, make reviews. And if you dive into my collection of videos, you're going to run into several reviews. I review the Logitech, if I'm trying to remember, uh, this Logitech, uh, man, this is this headset that I bought from Logitech. It was like $3.99. See, that's how long ago <laughs> I made that video. But I received a whole bunch of uh, responses. A lot of people enjoyed it, and they was asking me questions about that headset. So, uh, forgive me, I forgot the name of the, the the company who made that headset, but if you scroll down, you'll find it. And that's not the only tech review video that you will come across on my channel. You know, I'm looking at my 55-inch Sony Bravia TV, and I made a video review about that, and a lot of people really enjoyed that as well so what am I trying to say what I'm trying to say is that for the longest time you know I always thought of my video my, my channel as a small channel and most importantly I always thought of it as a visual diary something that I could leave behind for my family especially you know if I if the Lord decides to just take me home then at least I can just leave this behind for them so that they can just, you know, enjoy what I put together throughout the years. And, uh, but now, right, recently I have noticed that my subscribers list has increased. And I believe that the, 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 one of the reasons why that subscriber list on my channel has grown is because of this re recent video that I made about Kobe Bryant and that concept of his called Muse Cage and uh, when I thought about that and I started to see the numbers grow I said to myself wait a minute this is becoming more than just a visual diary I uh, I realized that the Lord has his hand on this channel, definitely. And for the for the longest time, his hand has always been all over this channel. In fact, I have numerous videos on my channel about the Word of God. But what but what I'm trying to say is that I'm going to focus more on God's word on this channel than anything else. Yes, I will still here and there make videos about Pac-Man or Donkey Kong or whatever. Something that I might find interesting. Something that might just catch my eye. And then I will say to myself, hey, I want to share that perspective, my, that perspective with you guys. Yes, that will happen. But I believe that this channel, if it 
if the, if it grows, right? If it ends up in the thousands and in the, in the in the millions. What I mean by that is that I'm I'm just a small little goldfish in this huge aquarium called the internet. YouTube is just such a huge enormous place and I'm just you know in the eyes of the regular viewers who check out YouTube on a regular basis I am a nobody really of course I am somebody in Christ but to the to the average YouTubers I'm just a I'm just a guy who has a low subscription list of subscribers but if this channel ends up having thousands of sub subscribers and probably millions of subscribers, then I'm definitely, definitely going to uh, make sure that God's word will be heard more than anything else. That's what I'm trying to say. So, in closing, I just want to thank those who recently decided to subscribe to this to this channel i'm not the type that will say hey you know uh make sure that you hit that like button and smack you know that 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 thumbs up or or, or click on that bell you know so that you will be uh notified about my uh next video i'm not that type of youtuber i have never been i'm just um, what i will do and it's something that i have always been doing is conclude my videos by saying may the lord jesus christ bless you and your families and i will always continue to say that because af after the ending of my videos i believe that it is best regardless of whatever it is that i'm sharing with you guys i have to conclude by uh showing the love of christ to you all and I know that many of you will check out my stuff and, and many of you will not agree with what I'm saying. And that's fine. You know, we as long as we could all agree to disagree agreeably, that's awesome. But you know how it is. You know, the reality is, is that, you know, the Internet could be a very toxic place. And <clears throat> and recently I have seen some of that toxic spill over in one of my recent videos, I'm referring to that Kobe Bryant uh, Muse Cage video. I had to block two people, unfortunately, because of their deliveries, you know, their lack of respect for me and for what I presented. I'm not going to go into that because no matter what I will say or do, there will be people out here that will not be happy. You cannot please everybody. All I can do is present the truth. And just like it says in the scriptures, the truth shall set you free. This is the preacher man signing out. May the Lord Christ, Yeshua, Moshiach, bless you all and your families. And in Christ's holy name, I say amen. Peace.